What's going on, Phil? It's Jim Colton, Mike Nash, and welcome back to Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. So, I have in my possession the fishing pole. Uh, so, I'm, I'm currently at the Gord Lake entrance. So, let's go to the public beach and see what happens. Oh, nothing. I figured it would, like, have a little thing pop up. Okay. Let's go to the boathouse and see if anything happens at that. The boat rental shop. Oh, nope. Anything gonna happen, uh, by, uh, by Lotto? Uh, Gord Lake Woods? There we go, we got something. 26, Gord Lake Woods. Hmm. Okay, Nick, this looks like a good spot, I guess, for fishing. A good spot, for what? Time to do some fishing! Uh, she's serious. Indeed she is. Um, what are you going to use for bait? Um... Me! Uh, oh. Yeah. Oh. Mmm. I figured something like this would happen. We should have brought Missile along with us, too. At least then we have bait, but we can only have one. Dot dot dot! N Nick! How could you? No, I'd like to catch something, you idiot. I'm kidding. Oh, I'm kidding. Hmm. Some jokes are better left untold. Wow, did she go all SJW on me or something? I need to fix my pop filter a little bit. Um, oof, she hit me! Oh, she did. Okay, watch this, Nick. Okay, just try not to reel in any empty cans or boots, okay? Here we go! Ack! My, my leg! My leg! Oh, God. Oh, <sighs> my, uh... <laughs> hey! What, what are you doing? Yeah, see. Sorry, Lada. Don't tell me y'all on some film company's payroll! Oh, okay. Nah. Nick, pay her. Uh, I, don't, I don't have enough money for this. See. Dear, dear. Okay. Uh, can we talk to her? Uh, not about anything we have to I guess. Let's go back in that case and get the, uh, the metal detector. Because I uh, can't think of anything else to do. Oh, AVG protected me from several threats recently. Thanks, AVG. It just decided now was a good time to pop up and tell me. Alright, let's go to the Criminal Affairs Department and uh, talk about secret weapons, specifically the Melotector. Grim Jig, we borrow one of the We've already seen all this. Uh, okay, let's borrow the metal detector. I'm gonna borrow that metal detector, sure thing, man. Uh, uh, sure thing, pal. I'm not sure what we're, we're gonna find with this. Uh, remember, you're hunting for a monster! Anything is possible! Anything! Anything is possible! Like, where did that come from? Borrow the metal detector from Gumshoe. Okay. In that case, let's. My, why am I checking the court record? Uh, let's go and move back to a, uh, Gord Lake entrance. And then to the Gord Lake Public Beach! And see if anything happens. The answer is no. Uh, let's go to the boat rental shop, see if anything happens there. Oh, something did- Beep, beep, beep! Oh, it's beeping. Okay, so the, so the metal detector has picked up something. Yay! N Nick! It's beeping! The metal detector's found something! So why would there be metal here? Uh, maybe- It's probably gonna give us some evidence that's not related to Gordy, but... Um... Let's see, so the boathouse has actually become useful for once. I'm sure it's loud enough about it. Whatever it is, it must be in those bushes. Okay, go check it out, Maya. Oh, I have to check it out, because you're my guinea pig. Dot dot dot! Nick! Look! Um... It's got an American, a Japanese flag on them, and I don't remember- recognize the other flag. Huh? An air tank? I must have all those flags. Huh, the valve looks broken. Oh no, steam's down! I thought it was Gordy. Yeah, Gordy would be in some bushes. Uh huh. My first of all, why would Gordy be in the bushes? <laughs> God damn. Uh, and second of all, why would a metal detector react to a sea monster? Uh, oh. Huh? There's some. There's something wrapped around this air tank. All those flags. It looks like a string of flags. Uh, what could that be? Well, might as well take it with us now that we found it. It's heavy. Picked up air tank of dubious value. Okay. Um, that's an interesting. Whoa, we did a flip again. Uh, okay. Let's go back to Lord Lake Public Beach. 
and head to the woods, see if the metal detector does anything there either. The answer appears to be no. Okay, so we have an air tank now. We still haven't found any info on Gordy. Uh, so let's go back to the entrance, I guess. And... Uh, now what? Go to the Ryan Cole offices, see if mine hasn't... Nope, nothing's gonna happen. Uh, Grosberg Law offices? Nope. Uh, Detention Center? No. Uh, the Criminal Affairs Department. There we go! Uh, well, it's always the last place to check. 726 Police Department Criminal Affairs. Okay. Hmm, the Tank of Gumshoe isn't here, so we can't return the metal. So I guess that was the correct option. Now you mentioned it, didn't he say he had a meeting to go to? Uh, he did, didn't he? Ah, uh, that's right, let's come back later. Okay, so we came just to have a conversation about how Gumshoe's not there anymore. Okay, I'm back, and, uh, I couldn't figure out what we was supposed to do, but right now, I'm um, so what we're supposed to do is present the, uh, the air tank to Larry, and, uh, Phoenix will ask him if it's his, which I guess makes sense, but I probably wouldn't do it. I had to look up a walkthrough. I went and made that connection myself, although it does make sense considering the inflatable thing in the background. Uh, what? Uh, let's see, what voice do I do for this guy? I always forget. What an air tank? What about it? See, actually, let me check the court record real quick. See, the air tank, see, it's an empty air tank, the valve is open, and the banner of flags wrapped around. That's its description. Okay, um, Larry, I wanted to ask you about this tank. Uh, and uh, it said to ask him, is it yours? Say, is this air tank yours? Well, why would I have a tank like that? Look, see how there's a string of flags around the tank? Oh, aha! Uh -huh. That does make sense, actually, because, you know, up here. He's a little bit smug looking right now. It's just like a string of flags around your steel Sam right there. Exclamation point! M must be a coincidence! Uh, yeah, probably not. Um, uh, there's string of flags everywhere these days. Really? Uh, the. Like, elementary schools. Uh, are you going around, uh, to elementary schools, Larry? Uh, do you, do you, can you have a seat, please? Uh, and use car dealerships. Why would I need a tank anyway? To inflate something, your little, uh, thingy there. You used this to inflate that, didn't you? Eh, uh, inflate what? Your seal samurai. What else? That big puffy seal samurai. Exclamation points! Dot, dot, dot. Uh, now why are you asking me a question like that? Uh, looks like I hit the nail on the head. The dot dot dot. Right, right. Actually, um, see the compressor I always use was on the fritz. Uh huh. So I tried using the tank to inflate just once. Uh, and it, it didn't go so well. Uh huh. But so how does it go in the seam? As I suspected, let's ask more about the tank. It didn't go so well. Er, yeah. Uh, do you think you could be a little more specific? <laughs> Come on! Look, it's embarrassing, so I don't really want to talk about it. Wait, tell us! Tell us! Maya's really eager, isn't she? Dot, dot, dot. Fine. Whatever. It's like what I said, the compressor's busted. So I took the tank and tried to fill the right up with that. Why was the compressor busted? And then... BAM! Oh! I see. Go is the steel samurai is Gordy the steel samurai? The the valve busted open and made this incredible noise. And that tank there took off like a rocket. And took my poor deflated steel samurai with it. What? Off into Gord Lake? Uh-huh. See. It should scare me out of my out of my gourd, that's for sure. So Gordy is actually Larry's steel samurai. God damn it. Okay, let's go to the woods and I guess tell a lot of that. Um, I guess, are we gonna have an option to talk to her? No, let's see. Let's save states. My phone's going off. Crap, I need, I, I need to remember to mute that. Let's see. Let's present the air tank to her and see what, what she says about it. Let's see. Yep, that's it. I know exactly squat about that. It's painfully easy knowing something doesn't catch a lot of interest. 
Uh, so, okay, that's not it. Okay, I'm back. It turns out it pulled the same thing on me as it did with, uh, with Grossberg. So we're, it's about, it adds an extra talk option of the flying air tank. So let's talk to Larry about that. Um, so, the tank was sealed samurai you tried to f fill up flew away. What happened next? Well, that happened on the 20, on the 20th or so. The 20th, a week ago. Okay. Now as far as I, now as far as I can see, you take my flying out into the lake. So I went out every night in the boat looking for it. I mean, Kiyotsu gave me that seal samurai after all. She did, huh? And when did you find it? Just the night before last. Uh, and why did he stash it in a bush? Um, okay. So, see, the night before last, see, it's currently the 26th, right? So that would be on the, t that would be on the 24th. Like, the same night as the murder. It flew, it flew way out there. It took me four whole days to find it. Okay, so yeah, that's the 24th, the night before last. Was the night of the murder. There is the other witness, isn't he? Sorry for not telling you, Nick. Actually, I was here in the night of the murder. Uh, yeah, he's the other witness, isn't he? But you see, I went home before midnight. Um, so, you didn't know about what happened? No. Uh, no. Uh, that's too bad. It's not all bad. That means he can't be a witness, I guess. We've solved one mystery, at least. A mystery? Maybe we should go tell her uh, about Gordy. That uh, Gordy is, in fact, a flying steel samurai. Okay, in that case, let's move. Now this should hopefully be it. Gord Lake Woods. And let's talk to her. Let's see, about Gordy. So now there's another thing for Gordy. Well, Mr. Lawyer! I've got the info y'all need! Y'all got the scoop on Gordy for me yet? Uh, Gordy doesn't exist, unfortunately. Uh, Lana, there is no such thing as Gordy. She's gonna want proof, isn't she? Whoa, what? How can y'all be so sure? R really Nick? Sorry, Maya. Um, y'all got some proof that Gordy don't exist? Uh, the proof that Gordy doesn't exist is here. Um, see, of course I have proof. No lawyer worth his badge would make a claim without the proof to back it up. Uh, I've done that a few times before. Here's proof that Gordy doesn't exist. Uh, it's the air tank. There he's, air tank? What are y'all doing with an air tank? This is Gordy. <laughs> oh boy. Um, excuse me? What exactly are you saying, Nick? My god, these Maya is as dumb as a rock. Um, hey, there's a stand near here. A hot dog stand. There's a giant inflatable samurai doll there. About a week ago, an idiot who <laughs> happens to be a friend of mine tried to fill it. Oh, God. He used his air tank, and when the valve blew, the tank flew into the lake. Apparently, it made a pretty loud bang when it flew. A bang? Yeah, she's not too bad. So, yep, that's Gordy. Tank along along with the still deflated steel uh, uh, along with the still deflated samurai fell into the lake. At the same time, that's a, so that's a steel samurai. A couple is taking a photograph of the lake. Wow, this photo. Wait, so you're saying that Gordy is really the steel samurai? Yes, I am. Dot dot dot. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, she's all depressed now. Well, that's a fun way to ruin the gal's dreams. Sorry about your whole investigative photographer career thing. I'm sorry, Lana. Nah, it's okay. You win. I'll give you your info like I promised. Okay, right. poor Lana. Okay, case information. Let's ask about that. So, tell us this information you have. A promise is a promise, I guess. I overheard the cops around here saying something about the witness tomorrow. It's Larry. They said he's the caretaker of the boat rental place up. Oh! It's not Larry. Okay. Um. Boat rental? The, the boat rental shop. There's someone there? I mean, it looks so deserted. Just an old guy living all by himself. Y'all should go check it out. Okay. Thanks, Lana. We will. I guess that's next. Uh, let's get cracking, Nick. Hold on! Something else? Yeah! Now the murder! My camera clicked twice, you know. Cause there were two shots, right? Wait. Dot dot dot. Wait. Wait. So you have another photo? Well... 
Yeah, but there's nothing in it at all. Just a link. Okay, that could be... Uh, I'll take it. I figured it wouldn't be much use as evidence, so I kept it myself. Well, it might not be helpful at all, but... Here, take it. It's gonna be helpful. Second lake photo, photo, second lake photo added to the court record. Oh, it's flipped again. Um, bye now. Y'all take care. Bye, Lada. Time for me to pack up and leave. Aww, poor Lada. Dot, dot, dot. Poor Lada. It's all, or it's all Larry's fault. It is indeed that bonehead. Uh, the legend still lives on, I guess. The legend? Yeah, the legend of Larry along with Zelda and Korra, familiar to all who know him for any length of time. When something smells, it's usually the butts. Yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> Someone should whip that butts into shape. <laughs> okay, so let's examine the court record for the second lake photo. We have an option to check it. Shows an empty lake, taken automatically on 12.24 at 11.50 p.m. That at least tells us what time it occurred. See, we don't actually, see, it looks like we don't actually have, oh, the original lake photo was taken at 12.15. Wait a second. That's fishy, because those are 25 minutes apart. Meaning, what, I mean, and see, Lana's deposition, uh, said that she heard that she heard two sounds like gunshots just after midnight. So that other photo is is not what Lana heard. That other photo, well, my guess is that other photo is the real time of the murder, or or, or I don't know. Someone's definitely curious here. Very curious. That I means, see, the pistol was fired three times. The pistol was fired three times. I'm just sort of doing my own little so... They, it was fired once. At 11.50. And... At, uh... And at 12, uh... Uh, and see, and at, at 12.15, it was fired two more times. That explains how Edra's fingerprints got on it. Was, he fired the first shot. And then, somehow, whoever the actual killer is, managed, uh, managed to, you know, grab the, uh, managed to get a hold of the gun. And, uh, or it could be, I just was just using his other hand, although his, his, let's see, whoever the, whoever the real killer managed to grab a hold of a gun and used it to frame Edgeworth. Huh. Hmm. This is, this is interesting. Okay, but I think that's all the interestingness we'll get for now. Uh, I'm gonna go to the public beach, but then I'm gonna end the video and in the next one we'll move on to the, uh, the boat rental shop. For now, I'll make a dash in the mouth.